A small discovery is now a pretty big deal in the world of insects, and it's all thanks to a UC Davis alum. How cool is this? CBS 13's Dom Garcia speaking to the UC alum and has some amazing video of a new species of praying mantis. You're looking at the newest official member of the praying mantis family, and this is the guy who discovered it, Lohit Garakapati. Have you always been into bugs, like even as a kid? Yeah, um, initially I was actually really into dinosaurs, but dinosaurs unfortunately aren't around. He first spotted the bug a few years ago in Arizona, but it didn't molt into an adult. And then years later, a friend of mine who lives in Arizona now sent me an adult that I realized immediately was the exact same mantis. I hadn't been able to find it for years. That friend is Peter Clausen. So Lohit actually named the new species after him, Stegmomantis clausenii, but its common name is the Sonoran tiger mantis. But one of the things that immediately separates it is the adults have this bright black coloration on their abdomen um, and it's on the top side. So they, they have tiger stripes, which is one of the reasons why I gave it that common name, the Sonoran tiger mantis. And then there's the way it tells predators to back off. And their wings also, the adult females have this beautiful red black coloration on their wings. Which is really unique. Lohit's discovery has gained national attention, especially in the insect world. But whether you're into bugs or not, he hopes this sparks something in everyone. Why is it important to make these kind of discoveries? I think it, it's it's sort of a way to revitalize people to get out and, and explore nature some more. Yeah, how cool is that? You may even find a new species. Lohit is now a PhD student at the American Museum of Natural History. With this discovery, there are now 28 described native species of mantises in the United States. Well done.